We have had a fabulous couple of days here at the University of Oregon. The weather has been spectacular. The conditions couldn't have been any better. Uh, had some great performances. It was a wonderful meet for us to, to come to, and I think that the athletes had a really, really special experience. Uh, had a couple of terrific things happen in the pole vault. Brooke Demo wins her section at 13 feet one, and, and Bo Morris wins his section at, at 16 feet seven. Those were good, solid performances. In the throws, we had a few good things happen. Kate Shockey wins the discus throw at 157 feet. Uh, Autumn Weaver goes second in the shot at 44 feet three. Brian Tapia throws fabulous in the discus throw, also had a really good personal record in the hammer throw, but his discus was a regional qualifier at 174 feet 11. Um, Erica Goveshi had a had a nice solid triple jump at 39 feet one inch. Um, Micah Land returns to, to NCAA qualifying form from when she was a freshman uh, with a 1021 personal record in the 3,000 meter steeplechase. I know that it was a great race for, for Geertz Aziz in the 1500 last night in spectacular Hayward Field conditions. He goes 342 for a beautiful run. Uh, Chelsea Baldwin runs a really nice personal record in the 5,000 meters at 1732. Uh, Jenna Wood runs under 18 minutes for the first time at 17 minutes and 40 seconds. Heather Klotz had a really beautiful run in the 1500, uh, had a 12 second personal record. Uh, we were really proud of Jared Foley in the 200 meters today, a, a, a really exceptional run. Luther Wilson had a couple of terrific hurdle races. He goes very solid in the 400 meter hurdles and he wins the high hurdles at, at 14 and 50 something. Both of our 4x400 meter relays on the men's side and the women's side had season bests. Really excited about Jenny Snyder's 100 meter hurdle run. She went 13.59, I believe it was, and, and th that was a significant step in the right direction.
just doesn't get, collegiate track and field just doesn't get any better than this right here at Hayward Field. This is a historic place. We're excited about Coach Hetzendorf throwing here later this summer in the Olympic trials, and I think all the athletes really had a special time here. So this was a big step toward our, our Missouri Valley Championship meet uh, three weeks from now. So we're really excited about this the way this went.